So I got a haul here of pre-orders. About four items this week. Wow, I did not expect to have this many items this week. Well, I guess I kind of did, but just, I don't know. Anyways, this one is really cool. I guess we'll start with the book, and then we'll go into the movies. Star Wars The High Republic, The Balance of the Force, Volume 2. Uh, yes, I, I love these High Republic books. I will be reviewing this one pretty soon. Uh, pretty excited about that, but yeah, I have Volume 2 now. I need to dive into this and uh, do a video. So that's pretty cool to have that. Uh, now I'm caught up in all the High Republic comics. At least I don't I do not do the, uh, at least the trade paperbacks. I don't do the uh, individual, whatever. Anyways, then I pre-ordered this as soon as it was announced because I had this on DVD. And I, you know, I'm not always like crazy about, oh, let me upgrade to 4K if I have it on Blu-ray. If it's a really movie I really, really like, or I feel like I can't deal with not having on 4K, I'll get it. I, but sometimes I just don't. Like, I have the Hunger Games movies on Blu-ray. Who knows if I'll ever upgrade those. I have the Expendables movies on Blu-ray. Who knows if I'll ever upgrade those, right? But if something's on DVD, I will gladly upgrade to Blu-ray. Blu-ray is lower quality. It, it takes up more space on the shelf. I want to have all my Blu-rays. You know, if I could have a collection of all Blu-rays, I would. But some there's shows and movies that will never get Blu-rays. So... But this one did from Sony, and that is American Pop. This is a really cool movie. That is a gorgeous cover, by the way. I, you know, the uh, Blu-ray did not have this. And you know, Ralph Bacci, he, he uh, did Fritz the Cat, the anime Lord of the Rings, and Wizards. He's a very legendary animator. I'm sure my audience uh, probably has heard about some of those movies at least. He's a very legendary filmmaker. Uh, this is a very 1970s movie. It's got tons of music in it from uh, The Doors, from Jimi Hendrix, and so many other people. Uh, Janis Joplin, Leonard Skinner, Bob Seger, like just so many others. They're all listed on the back here. Here's the back there. But yeah, this is just a Blu-ray. There's nothing too special about this. Uh, we're pretty lucky to get that. This was kind of pricey, but I did really want it. It was 25 bucks. So I could see it getting cheaper, but if, but if, but you know, so few of his movies are actually on Blu-ray that I would, I jumped on this. I also have the Fritz the Cats movies. And then this one was an Arrow Video 4K. Got it for 55, uh, 50, not 55, 50% off. Because there are, of course, Arrow Videos doing their 50% off sale. And this was included in that. And I, I mean, I wanted this anyways. Because I, mean, I wanted this when they put out the Blu-ray. And now that they upgraded to 4K, made me glad I waited. But that is weird science. Weird science! I, I love John Hughes. But I've never seen this movie. So I'm curious about it. Heard great things. Here's a poster. I'm not going to undo the poster here. But, you know, it's got the... Uh, uh, another Arrow video ad thing. Whatever. Um, and then here's the booklet here. With the lead actress on the back there. You know, some cool, uh, some cool, uh, weird stuff in here. You know, images from the move, movie read-ups. Pretty cool. And then you get the one 4K disc, which has a lot of special features. You can look all that up. Um, but yeah, pretty cool set for 25 bucks. Really great deal. It's still 25 bucks if you guys want it. I definitely had to jump on this set. I do really love this slipcover. That is a gorgeous slipcover. Oh, it looks, the feel of it's really nice. I actually really like that. So, cool to have that. And then this one was like a must-have. Like if I, if, like if, like if you held a gun to my head right now and said, "Hey, look, you can only pick one of these titles to get." This was the one I had to get. This is my second favorite movie of all time. And this is kind of a no-brainer that Disney would release this on 4K. But also, kind of felt like maybe Disney would never do this because they've waited so long. But I finally, they finally did it. And, oh my god. Nightmare Before Christmas in 4K. Look at this gorgeous slipcover. This is just gorgeous. I just, oof. It looks like they carried over all the same uh, special features. You got the uh, uncut uh, Frank and Winnie. Um, which is yeah, this is the live action Frank and Weenie, so that's included on here. You get the Vincent short, um, I believe. Yep, uh, you, you get uh, 
Tim Burton's original power narrated by Christopher Lee. What's what's this Jack's Haunted Mansion holiday tour? Deleted scene. Making a Nightmare for Christmas. Audio comment song selection. So there's a lot of stuff on here. And good on Disney for actually putting on bonus features. Because they're so lazy with their releases now. But yeah, this is a great uh, compilation of new releases this week. You know, books, movies, whatever. Pretty cool to have all these. I have more haul videos coming soon, so stay tuned for that. But I'm absolutely super excited to have all these. Let me know your thoughts, like, share, and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching.